Hi, I'm Robert with Acme Locksmith in Arizona. Today I'm going to be talking to you about one of two ways that somebody can use to get into your home in less than 10 seconds and leave absolutely no visual evidence as to how they gotten in. Now, if you're interested in learning about the way we're not talking about today, click on the link below called Lock Bumping. Now today I'm actually going to demonstrate this technique for you, but it's important to know I'm not showing you quite everything that you need to know to use this technique, but you'll see just how easy it is to use this technique in my demonstration. But this is not a how-to video, it is a how-to stop it video. And the great news is you could stop somebody from breaking into your home using this technique for no money. Zero dollars is all it takes to fix this problem, so go out and get taken care of today. Today we're talking about how somebody can get into your house in less than 10 seconds through that door. So this is the culprit right here. Every garage door opener has an emergency release latch. You can see it right there at the top. And that latch, typically, unless you removed it, has a cable that hangs down. That's so you can quickly disengage it if you ever have to disengage your garage door opener and swing it open. But here's the thing that most people don't realize. When you close your garage door, that latch gets closer and closer to the edge of the garage. So once that garage is fully closed, that is hanging right in front of your garage door. And that's what we're gonna to use to get into this home. Let me go outside and show you how it's done. So now we're outside the garage door. Now remember, with the garage door down, it can't be open because the garage door opener is actually securing this door in place. But the emergency release for that garage door opener lies right behind this door. Now what I have in my hand here is just a regular everyday clothes hanger that I bent in the shape and I can slide this clothes hanger into the door. So trying to grab that rope, give it a pull, there it is, release it, and I'm in, less than 10 seconds. Now remember, the only thing you need to do to stop somebody from getting into your home this way is to actually cut this cord off. It doesn't cost anything. It can be done very, very quickly and it'll prevent somebody from getting into your home undetected. Now, if you like this video, please click like below. And if you want more updates on products and security tips, subscribe to the Acme Locksmith page. Thank you so much.